I'm getting up, Sam. If you turn around, <gasps> I'll pull the trigger. Don't do it, Paul. <laughs> What's up, everybody? It's the King Toys coming at you, and let me introduce you to Psych. This game really seems like it has some promise. I see that there's already like a full version out there. I'm pretty sure it's a full version. It's about 10 bucks to buy it. But there was also a demo available. So I was just like, hey, I'll try the demo. It looked pretty awesome. And all I kept getting was this freaking warnings telling me that there's gonna be a bunch of crazy material. Jump scares are imminent. Viewer discretion advised pretty much. So let's see what Psych has to offer. I feel like this is gonna it's be been good. A whole year since I've seen my family. Oh my god. After the accident, I was in hospital for a very long time. However, there was none nearby, so I had to be placed in one in the next town. Well, shit, sir. Unfortunately, I can't remember the accident either, and I only know that I drove off the road in a car. And because of this accident, I developed a behavioral disorder. More precisely, a post-traumatic stress disorder. Of course! It made me imagine things and caused me to behave uncontrollably. Oh, God. Oh, so God! So I transferred from the hospital directly to the nearest clinic for mentally disturbed people. Oh, God! No visitors were allowed there. Not even my own family. And that's where the year went by? It took me almost or... a whole year to deal with the behavioral disorder. <clears throat> and even now, it isn't normal. So I'll probably have to live with it until further notice. They didn't want to talk to me about the exact causes and said that such disorders can often occur in such accidents. Anyway, the day after tomorrow is my little sister Sam's birthday. She'll be 16. So, I thought that on the day of my release, I would meet Sam directly and we would go to our parents' house to celebrate her birthday. She called me right after my release and said that she'd found a park nearby where we can meet. It's already quite late, so I have to hurry. Why a park? Why is it so late? Oh god. Oh. 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 New message. I thought that was me. From Sam, perhaps? Press up to take your phone out. Oh god. Why is there uh, that caution tape? All right, R to open messenger. Hey, Alex, I'm waiting. What does it say? I'm waiting at the phone booth near the pond. Just go left when you come from the entrance. Okay. Put the phone away. Put the phone away, sir. Yeah, isn't this creepy enough? I mean, besides the fact that your brother, I guess speaking from Sam's perspective, your brother just got out of like a mental, in, mental, mental institution. And then you want to go, as soon as he gets out, you want to meet with him alone. Oh, God. In the dark, at a park, that's not at all weird. Is the ringing coming from a phone booth? Should we even care? Honestly. Ah, oh God, oh, I'll answer the phone. What I'll... is this pain? Okay. I have your sister come to the other side of the pond, take a seat and let's talk a bit. Well, what the f uh, what does it say? Oh! Sam? Sam? I can't run. I can't run, Sam. This is not a thing that's gonna be... Which way to the pond? Pond this way. Okay. Yeah, for some reason, your sister's yelling off in the distance, but we're not gonna fucking run. We're just gonna casually walk. Okay. Um. Yeah, it's a fucking tiny pond. How do I do this? No, put that away, you asshole. How do I sit? I'm here. I am here. I am here. How do I- No, put that away. Put that away. God damn it. Can I go through here? <gasps> Is this where you wanted me to go? <gasps> oh! What? I am a murderer, Emily. I'm a goddamn murderer, and I'm so fucking sorry. I didn't mean it. I really didn't mean it. Please believe me. I was so, so pissed that you kept this from me, and when I came to you, you were already... My God, Emily. I'm so fucking sorry. I know I can never make it up to you, but I promise I will take care of Jack with all my strength. I am such a bad father, such a goddamn bad father. 
Now Jack will have to grow up without a mother, and that's all because of me. I wish, even though I know it won't happen, that we will see each other again in the next life. I hope you are well in heaven. Husband Paul. Jump scare? Oh, I thought this pond was a lot smaller from over there. Well, shit, son. Is this Paul's doing? Or is that just a whole separate thing right there? Ooh. 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 Ooh, there's a lot going on. Missing person disclosure? Oh, Emily. I think I know where Emily is at. According to new reports, Emily, a married woman... <laughs> To think that if, like, a magazine or a newspaper really said it like that, Emily, who's a married woman, that'd be just, I don't know, hilarious, I guess, was last seen with her husband Paul and her son Jack in the park near their clinic for mentally disturbed people. According to witnesses, Emily was often, or also, wait, according to witnesses, Emily also often went to the park alone at night to sing near the pond. When a witness asked her why she sang there, she replied that it calmed her down after every argument with her husband. In view of this, her husband disappeared with their son without a trace. The husband is under investigation. If you have any clues or information, please come to the local Hwinevale police station and con or contact us. Chess? Anybody want to play some chess? Well, don't mind if I do, sir. But now what are we waiting for? Oh Hello? shit. Who's that? Jump scare? What the hell is this? I feel like I see something over there. Was that just a joke from Sam? If so, this is anything but funny, Sam. Can I get up? Um I'm getting scared. I'm, patience. I'm getting up, Sam. If you turn around, I'll pull the trigger. Don't do it, Paul. Quiet now. Good boy. Listen to me carefully. I just want to see if you'd shoot me. Sweet little sister, Sam has stolen something that doesn't belong to her. What the hell, Sam? Of immeasurable value. Oh, we took her to a safe place. We? What? Sam, why do you gotta play with these people? What kind of puzzle? What are you talking about? The puzzle is... Oh, fuck. <laughs> the puzzle is, uh, you're gonna get knocked out. Okay. My head. Where am I? You woke up just in time. You have exactly 15. <clears throat> minutes before the drug takes effect. Mm. The drug? Why did you do that? What, what is going on here? Well, I gave you a drug that was supposed to kill you after one hour. You've been out now for exactly 42 minutes. Well, you just injected me? Three minutes for the drugs to take effect. So, you have 15 minutes left before you start to feel Oh, sorry. God. What the fuck did you do that for? Fucking now, now. You fucking cunt. Chance to save yourself and your thieving little sister. I've hidden an antidote in a box, <sighs> sealed with a cord. Your first clue to the code is by the phone box. I know where that's at. Good luck. Get up. Get up. Fucking hell. This can't be happening. Yeah. And again, walking, walking. This is the demo, so I hope at least in the full version of the game that this isn't just what it is, because I'm fucking walking, dude. It seems like you would have some haste. A little bit of pep in your step, sir. Enter a number. Call me. Oh, if you add up the first two digits of the American emergency call, what do you get? 11, right? 9, 10, 11. Okay, I, I did it. Oh God, oh God, please don't, please don't. I don't understand. You st 
Who the fuck was that? The number you have reached has been changed. Oh, the first two digits. It's fucking... You fucking bastard. These are the first three of four digits to the code. Hurry up. Oh god. Yeah, I heard your little fucking noises and shit. Missing cat. Call him. Okay. The entrance. The entrance. Now hurry up. And then I got the phone. Where the heck are you? I'm at the pond near the construction site. This construction site, please hurry up. Okay. Wells, miss. Oh yeah, I do got a little pep in my step, but it doesn't really do anything for me. So that said the entrance. And then she's talking about the construction site. And those are two different fucking places. But I highly doubt going to the construction site right now is probably something to kind of fuck me up oh 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 okay I'm going towards the van who's over there messing with that van freaking little children you little hoodlums messing with my van the human being is infinite in its value. yes sir it is so I guess I'm gonna go through all these Whoa, why'd I do that? <gasps> nice. Finally, the antidote. Oh, that's a lot of antidote. Do you think you needed it all of that? Uh, Sam. I have to find Sam. Okay. Where do you want me to look? What the Uh Uh no. The fuck no. Construction site, apparently. Sam, your ass is a fucking grass. Putting me through this shit. You stealing shit from people? Yeah. Where are you? Oh, 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 oh. What the fuck? Sam? Were you in on this the whole time? Oh. Thank you for playing. Please add Psych to your wish list. For being a demo, I mean, I guess, I mean, it, it it's kind of intriguing. I mean, there is aspects of it that I did like. I like the backstory coming into it. I mean, the pacing is, I guess it's good. When you got a scary game, really running is not the thing for it slow walking and i know it's a drag but it is kind of perfect for it um even kind of like the other little backstory that's happening like we got our main backstory for our character what he's been going through what he's doing at the park now right but then also reading those like newspapers and the freaking see in the grave and just all that and the letter from paul you see that there's something else going on too. Like, what the fuck is this? There's this, obviously a killer Paul. He's a murderer, right? He said, I'm a murderer. So there's, I don't know, there's things that I like of it. But this was really short for being a demo. I thought there would be more to it. I mean, really all I did was this, go to the meeting place. Then all the bullshit went down. Then I went to a phone booth. And then I went over there to the fucking little safe thing to get the antidote. And then through process of elimination, right? Because I had the first three numbers and I needed only four. So the process elimination, I was able to figure it out. Get the antidote, chug a bunch of pills. And then, you know, there we go. Like, that's it. But I mean, it was good. I'm curious of what the full release would be. And then at the end, it was like, what? Sam was in on this? Is she a part of this? Like... 
if she's in on it, then what the fuck does that have to do with me? Right? Or her brother. Or I don't fucking know. So, yeah. Psych, man. Psych? You thought you were going to go meet up with your sister. Psych? <laughs> it was a good demo. Very quick, and I thought there would maybe be more to it since there is a full release of the game. I think it's a full release. I'm not sure. But, nonetheless, this was good. Just wish it was a tidbit longer. Demos are supposed to be a taste, but I feel like this wasn't even a taste. This was like just a smell. <laughs> but I'm going to end the video right here. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you. Peace. <laughs>